This week, we don't have Maddie. That scares me, but I have the next best thing. While Maddie's away, I need someone to stand in for her. Somebody that is going to be a consistent winner. That's why I'm bringing in Brynn. The group routine is an idea taken from an old movie, The Boy in the Plastic Bubble. One of you is actually going to be in a bubble. <gasps> so going into this competition, we're going up against rivals. The last time we saw these people at Nationals, you lost. They're on top now. They hold the power. They can intimidate you if you let them. Of course, the first week back, our rival BDA is up against us. After the second place loss at Nationals, we have to redeem ourselves. The boy in the plastic bubble. It's a type of immune deficiency where a child can't be touched. They can't go outside. They're allergic to other people. And if they catch these germs, they can die. OK, come get in it. Come get in it. Bubbles happening. Whoever is inside the bubble has to be so animated that the judges can see the acting capabilities and what they're trying to tell, what the story is. When you want somebody that's big and animated, I think JoJo fits the bill. But you can only be, you can only be in it for nope, five minutes. Nope, they're blowing minutes. up JoJo. Oh. How is she going to breathe? Oh my God. I guess if she passes out after a couple of minutes, we know there's no ventilation in there. When we open this, you need to suck the air and get in, OK? Let's practice that one time. Yeah. Oh my God, that's making me panic. Ready? No. Well, I can't get it open. Wait, I have to, like. The zipper's stuck. Oh, God. Take her out. Get her, get her out of here. Okay, unzip her, please. It's hard. Well, it's she's really taking hard. a breath. Come on, breathe. Yeah, so you can't breathe. <gasps> OK. You OK? I'm good. That's All right, fun. Good job. <laughs> of course, Abby would put JoJo in the bubble with only five minutes of air. The more JoJo talks, the less air she's going to have. I mean, is this Abby's grand plan to keep JoJo's mouth shut? That zipper looks so bad where it is right now. I think that turn inside would be hard. It Robert. looks hard. Like, the plastic would get caught up under your foot. Or the zipper. Open it up. Open it up. There's a lot. They're doing a lot in that. They're rolling her. They're unzipping uh -huh. it. That's a lot. But it was at the right spot. Like, what if it's underneath? They're going to have to, like, Yeah, I didn't even think of that. Competition is tomorrow, and this group dance needs a lot of help. I mean, this is a giant hamster ball that the girls have to manipulate and move and dance around. There's a lot of room for error. This is the first competition of the season, and already I feel an enormous amount of pressure. We're going up against BDA this week, who are our rivals and the defending national champions. This is going to be a long day. You're not saying that this will happen, but what if the zipper gets yeah, hurt? What's the plan B, just in case it doesn't really budge? Scream fire. At the end of the dance, if you're in trouble and you can't get her out, you need to scream so that people come running out and help you. Let's go. Judging number 28, team group specialty, the girl in the plastic bubble. I thought the group dance was amazing. We didn't have to scream fire, which is really good. And I'm just really excited to see how we do, and I hope we win. Are we ready for the adjudicated scores? Team yeah. BDA beat us at nationals last year, and we have to redeem ourselves. First place for team group. The girl in the plastic bubble. Winning the competition against BDA is kind of like a payback. So it feels really good. And I'm just happy that we won, because we're probably going to have a really good week next week.